There's a great scholar by the name of Muhammad Mukhtar Shankiti who made this comment that's very profound. He said that have people reached a point in their ignorance of Allah that they don't even know how to call out to him anymore. They don't even know how to have a personal conversation between them and God. And if you think about what a personal dua looks like, the word in Arabic is munajat, they're pleas. What a personal plea and call looks like to Allah. Allah doesn't care if you rhyme or how you sound or you know, even sometimes you can call out to Allah in whatever language, it doesn't matter. It's about how sincere it is. Imam Ahmed, may Allah have mercy on him, he was asked, what is the distance between us and the throne of God? He said, a pious prayer from a pure heart. That's how we connect to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And though we look at the prophetic prescriptions of prayer and the best prayers, the best supplications are the ones taught to us by the Quran, by divine revelation and by the Prophet, peace be upon him, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa largely encouraged the people around him to learn to call upon Allah in a personal way, in a very personal way. And if you look at the companions of the Prophet, peace be upon him, they're essentially a generation of yaqeen. They're a generation of certainty. They're a generation of being connected to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in their own unique ways. So what we're gonna do this Ramadan, inshallah, is we're actually going to take a prayer every single day from one of our pious predecessors, mostly from the companions, and learn how to call upon our creator the same way that they called upon him. And what I want you to do is to actually follow along with this series on a daily basis, but also have your own dua journal, your own prayer journal, where you start to write down your own prayers following the same mannerisms that they used. And hopefully we can connect to Allah the way that they connected to Allah. So I pray that you'll join me every day by clicking on the link below, share it with everyone that you know, and make sure that you also keep us in your prayers.